Hello, everyone, and welcome to the sound live. Starting off, we have the OG guest, the first guest I had on the channel, Jennifer Valiquette. That's right, saxophonist, flute player. How you doing, Jennifer? Good. How are you? So we've been we've been doing the guitar studies on Fridays, and you were just mm -hmm. telling me you're you're adding some more repertoire. I'm proud of you. Keep up the Thank good work. Thank you. Thank you. I added. I'm trying to learn Hallelujah because the chords. You taught me the chords to that already. So <laughs> I have another incredible guest. I have Evelyn Holland. Evelyn is a guitar player, singer, and songwriter, and she is awesome. Everybody, welcome, Evelyn. How you doing? Uh, I'm good. It's a it's a nice day here in Portland, and um, yeah, I'm feeling pretty good today. Yeah, me too. I'm excited to do some music reactions and reviewing. Yeah. So, yeah. So you said you you just you just started playing with a new band. Why don't you tell me a little bit about that? They're called Magdaline, and they just lost half of their uh, lineup recently. I think in the last couple months or something like that. They're gonna bring in the bass player soon here they've been getting together with him separately as well they're signed to a nuclear blast subsidiary oh which is a big, big, big metal label i'm sure you know oh yeah wow. i i enjoy the uh, jamming with them on like just you know like we definitely uh there's chemistry there and there's personal chemistry which is important Definitely. Excellent. Well, congratulations. You know, I'm just so excited to play. I miss it so much. And we're going to start now with Eve's pick. Why don't you introduce us to what we're going to be reacting to real quick here, Eve? I, uh, yeah, I figured I'd give a little exposure to one of my friends in Montana. Uh, mm -hmm. He performs everything on this drums, bass, guitar, vocals, writes all the lyrics, does all the production. Um, yeah, and I've he was in the Minneapolis scene for a while, and I saw him do it live by himself with like a little uh, I forget what he told me it was, but it stored all his layers, and and he he just he was there on stage by himself playing, and it sounded it sounded so full considering that it wasn't like a full band because usually when it's like a one man band in the past, like there's maybe one or two people that. Uh, uh you know sound good doing that and yeah he's just he just made the production sound so full that it didn't matter that he was just the only one standing on stage yeah. um cool this uh this is a this is a little bit heavier this is kind of uh more in a black metal direction but it's very melodic too um uh yeah extremely melodic uh, it just like the melodies ooze out of this guy I, I love it. I'm a huge fan. All right. So without further ado, Musicians Panel reacts to Anephirin. An 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 anephirance. Oh, an okay. Without further ado, Musicians Panel reacts to Anephirins. This onward reach, the official single of 2018. Here we go. There we go.
School Breakdown. what he did to the like as far as effects but it makes it sound so uh, uh like, not it's like <laughs> yeah it it's like different like, it yeah. yeah 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 <laughs> yes <laughs> Awesome. I like nice the nice it is. Like, makes me see colors every time he plays differently. Like, I don't know, there's something in my brain that makes me see things when the music's playing. So it's kind of like when the music was all pumping and I would close my eyes, I would see like something going like that, you know? Uh -huh. And when it was more calm, I would see kind of like waves, even if my eyes were closed, because I don't know, maybe I'm just. Crazy, yeah, but, no, yeah. That, that, <laughs> that that's what I. That's how I. That like, um, it it just it just trances you out, and yeah, like the cult seeing colors, and all that. You can kind of meditate in it, even mm -hmm. though like you know there are heavy elements and all that. It's very, uh, yeah, <laughs> very just floaty, floaty. <laughs> yeah, I agree. It it did seem a lot. It did seem a little floaty, and it, it was just 
like at first I was kind of like, oh, okay, so this is a different style of music that I'm not used to, but I really loved it though. It, it was so cool and the, the solos mm -hmm. and everything, like very cool. Yeah, it's really good. The the screaming stuff, the <laughs> I just that's not my thing. Um, I couldn't <laughs> understand those lyrics, um, so I it just I don't know that. The, the music behind all that was pretty cool. Then it went off into this instrumental where they were doing like the the six eight thing or twelve eight whatever it was, and um, that was really 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 cool. And then yeah. they came in with the with the, the the more you know singing vocals that were like really breathy and ethereal sounding, and some harmonies with that, and it was kind of swirling sounding, and that was really really nice as well. Um, the the whole ambiance of the outro was really nice. Good. It left you feeling settled at the beginning though the first minute or two minutes was definitely unsettled um the, <laughs> the, the mix was interesting the mix was interesting and that's probably because it's a solo artist um probably whatever they're playing live is a little bit extra higher in the mix maybe um mm -hmm. but it was it was definitely good and um you know especially at the beginning the drums were just baffling to me they were just like like the first minute or two was like and i'm just like yeah. i'm just i just don't i don't get into that i don't i'm not trying to say i think it's bad it's just you know so if i was going to listen to that song again i probably would like skip a couple minutes into it and let it play to the end yeah how do you do that kind of like like singing that he did in the beginning is that like a growling thing <clears throat> a, uh it's uh, it's a matter of distorting your voice um vibrating your throat right yeah that would hurt though wouldn't it would that hurt or no uh, no there's way there's ways that you can do it and not mm -hmm. hurt your voice <sighs> There you uh, go. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't say I couldn't do it. I just said I didn't like it. <laughs> Fair enough. Yeah. No, it's it's um I it's an element of music that I I enjoy because I think the uh, aggressive and the darker elements are just as important as those lighter elements. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think I heard a little vocal fry in there too, right? I'm sure. Yes. Yeah. Matthew's yeah. been teaching me some of that, so <laughs> You guys are awesome. I loved all the suggestions from today. So everybody, make sure you go and check out all their channels. Um, there's links in the description already, so you can go right there. Jennifer's music page, right? Go there. Evelyn Holland down here, right? Oh, over there. Yeah, backwards. Yeah. Over there. And then Sarah yeah. Olson, okay? Everybody, make sure you go and subscribe to all their channels. We're creating this awesome network here where we all are just sharing and being friendly and just sharing our thoughts and our feelings about music, and we're having a great time doing it. Make Thank sure you, you check out – you're welcome. Make sure you check out my Patreon, patreon.com slash Matthews Music Lesson Studio, where you can get bonus content and you can support the channel directly. Please – like, share, subscribe right here. And if you're interested in music lessons, Matthews Music Lesson Studio.com, where you get to record the lessons and keep them forever. So I will see you guys next time. Thank you, guests Woo! on the sound live. Do 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 do